One thing that happens to me is I'll check my phone in the morning to see what time it is. Cause I'm like, it feels too early to get up. Sometimes it is, sometimes it isn't. But that's not a very good idea because if you have a notification on your phone that's kind of important, that will wake you up very quickly, whether you actually wanted to get up or not. I did not want to get up this morning when I did, but I saw that notification and I was like, oh, I'm up. <laughs> oh well. Man, kind of struggling today. I figured going for a light run would probably help. But so far, it's working. I use the time of day as like a rough indicator of how I'm on track for things. I just have no idea. No idea if I'm on track for anything right now. Okay, uh, today I'm gonna start the edit for our April Fool's video. That April Fool's video, it's gonna be very entertaining. Uh, I don't wanna ruin the surprise, but <laughs> it's gonna be good. <laughs> Anyways, that run did the trick. It's really borderline sometimes. Sometimes running will make it worse, sometimes running really helps. Today it really helped. Time to get to work. All right, some good work done. That April Fool's video is gonna be very funny, very entertaining. Um, but thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Hello, welcome back to the vlog. My mother must have done some sort of uh, grocery order and I'm eating this, whatever this is. <laughs> Just for you, unless you decide to share or it gets stolen. <laughs> I'm just kidding. If she left it out here, it's for me to eat. Hopefully. <laughs>
So obviously I haven't talked about it that much, but the war going on on the other side of the world is extremely depressing. It's weird because I just keep thinking, I'm like, oh, it's 2022. Certainly things like this won't happen anymore, right? And now you can see it all happen. Like you just, you can just look at videos of it happening and you're like, who would do this for any reason? For any reason, why would you do this? Why would you cause people to suffer like this? I just cannot fathom it that you can do this to other human beings. And you know what's weird too, is that World War II, this war of like an unbelievable scale was not that long ago. It was like 80 years ago. This one grandma away from us. And it's like the weird thing now about living in a global society is that you know what's happening on other parts of the world. And yet I can continue to live in this peaceful existence because I'm not there. It's always been like that. There's always been crazy things going on somewhere in the world. And then somewhere on another part of the world, you get to live in relative peace. I just don't understand why that is not the number one goal at all times. You have these people who just can like justify anything in their minds that this is the right thing to do. If peace is not the ground floor of anything you do, then what are you even doing? Like, I mean, I suppose it's one way to exist, but it's not the way I want to exist. <laughs> oh, so it only really glows on the outside. Yeah, but when it's really dark and you look at it from far away when it's doing that, it looks kind of like 3D. Mm. You can change the colors too? Yeah. And you could just go to a straight color. Or switch. There's the yellow for supersonic. Okay, well that's gonna do it for today's vlog. Thank you very much for watching, as always. Um, I will see you in the next one, whenever that's gonna be. Join us on Sunday. Oh, yeah, join us on Sunday for the premiere of the 50th episode. Public release this Sunday, April 1st, something good. April, April 3rd, we'll probably do the Virgin Falls solo hike. After that, we'll be filming the 51st episode. Lots of stuff to come. Okay, but thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Almost fell on that one. <laughs>